Eastern Hognose Snake Nature's dramatic performer The Eastern Hognose Snake, Heterodon platerinos, is a unique reptile native to North America, particularly found in the eastern United States and parts of southern Canada. Eastern Hognose Snakes are medium-sized, typically ranging from 20 to 35 inches in length. They are characterized by an upturned snout, which they use to dig and burrow in sandy soils. Their coloration is highly variable, ranging from solid shades of grey, brown, or olive to more vibrant patterns that include orange, yellow, or reddish blotches. These snakes prefer habitats with sandy soils, such as pine forests, fields, and coastal areas. They are often found in areas with loose soil that allows them to burrow easily. Eastern hognose snakes primarily feed on amphibians, especially toads, which they are specially adapted to hunt. They have enlarged teeth at the back of their mouths that help them puncture inflated toads, allowing them to swallow their prey more easily. When threatened, the eastern hognose snake puts on a theatrical display. It flattens its neck and body, hisses loudly, and mimics the behavior of venomous snakes like coppers. If this doesn't work to deter predators, it resorts to playing dead by flipping onto its back, opening its mouth, and remaining motionless. This death feigning is one of the most unique and entertaining behaviors in the reptile world. Despite its menacing display, the eastern hognose snake is non-venomous and harmless to humans. Its dramatic bluff is entirely a defense mechanism to avoid predation. The snake's diet primarily consists of toads, which secrete toxins as a defense mechanism. Eastern hognose snakes have developed a resistance to these toxins, allowing them to consume toads without being harmed. Their specially adapted jaws and teeth help them deal with toads that inflate themselves as a defense. The color and pattern of eastern hognose snakes can vary significantly even within the same population. This variability can make them difficult to identify at a glance and adds to their beauty and intrigue. Their characteristic upturned snout is not just for show, it's a practical adaptation that allows them to dig in sandy soils, whether for burrowing or uncovering prey like toads and other small creatures. In addition to their defensive display, their coloration often serves as camouflage in their natural habitats, helping them blend in with leaves, sand, or underbrush.